to set up and use PPSSPP PSP emulator, start in the App Store, select the PPSSPP PSP emulator, and tap to install. Once we open the emulator, we need to provide our own games. I will show you how to prepare them for the emulator. So let's start by opening up the files app. If we see some random screen, just tap back until you see browse. Now select on my iPhone and your games are typically stored in this downloads folder or they are stored in iCloud Drive and then downloads. So I'm going to go to the path where my games are located. Now the games must be in .iso format in order for them to work with PPSSPP. So if they're in zip, just tap the zip to extract. But if they're in .7z.rar, tapping won't work. So to extract those files, you search for iZip in the App Store and get the iZip Zip Unzip Manager. It is free to download. Then you would long press on your 7z file I'm using zip, but the steps are the same. Then select share. And you're going to tap to open your file into iZip. And we'll close any prompts. And then we will use iZip to unzip the file. So tap on OK and patiently wait for your game to unzip. If I go to the previous screen, you can see I have extracted 7-zip raw files in the past. So let's find where the .iso is located and just select the .iso by tapping the circle, then select the share button, then select save to files. And now we can put the game back into our files app and it will be in the acceptable format. Tap save to save this. You may notice it looks like we could import the PSP game by opening a PPSSPP. However, this feature doesn't work. So what we're going to do is we're going to long press our game in the files app and we're going to select move, then swipe back until you see browse. We're going to go to this path on my iPhone or on my iPad. Then scroll down and select PPSSPP. Then select PSP. Then we can either move the game here, or what I would do is long press on the empty space, select new folder, and then just put games like this, and then move your game into the games folder. Now we're going to open PPSSPP and we see the PSP folder, tap into this one, then tap your games folder you created, you will see it here, and now our game's loading up. Just tap the game, then tap the empty space and you're good to go. If you tap this arrow here, then tap on settings. You can customize so many settings. 